Hi there, this is Ike from Spots Home London and today we're going to be seeing a lovely five bedroom flat in South West London. We're in Roehampton, so with that said we have Roehampton University nearby, Richmond Park, lots of nearby. Right outside of the flat in fact we do have a co-op, so we've got the grocery shop in right around the corner, it's going to be one minute to get to. We also do have Subway and other restaurants, so very fantastically located in terms for that. Now also for transportation we do have Barnes Railway Station, that's going to be only about a 10 minute journey away, that's by bus. And then a bit further out we have East Putney with the district line there, that's going to be about a 15 minute journey by bus. And as for the flat we're going to be seeing all five rooms, so let's go ahead and see them. So here's the entrance to the flat. First thing to the right will be the first bedroom. So we've got a bedroom to the right, the toilet is going to be here to the left along with a shower. So that's in there. We also have a window, so it lets in a lot of natural sunlight. Now as for this bedroom, it will be labelled bedroom one on the floor plan, and the landlord has their own labelling system, so this would be bedroom A. So in this room we get a double bed, which is to the left as we enter. In front will be the chest of drawers and then along the right wall we have extra storage with shelving and a standalone wardrobe along with a desk and TV in the center. So now we also get a window that overlooks the front and that's this room. Next, we of course have steps that lead up to the remaining bedrooms and bathroom. However, before that, we'll have the kitchen. And as we saw, we have a living room space with the couch and access to the patio. So here's the kitchen. We've got the countertop space all along this wall. So on top, we have the stove. Oven is going to be underneath that. Dishwasher moving along sink and then here in the far corner we have the washing machine microwave kettle and toaster and up above we've got a lot of space for kitchenware and food we can see that behind the glass cupboards and then here at the end of the kitchen we've got the fridge and freezer so that's in there now this bedroom here to the right would be bedroom number two or as the landlord labels bedroom B however we won't be seeing that today and then here out back we have a very nice patio area a few chairs and table down to the right with some cover and then in the distance we can see the neighboring gardens also so let's just get a view of the back of the flat So we can see, it looks like this, so we are on the ground floor, and then we can see the flats above. So now we'll head upstairs to see the remaining bedrooms and bathroom. So the stairs are carpeted and they'll lead us to this floor where we can see we have bedrooms to the left. And on the other side, we'll have another bedroom as well as the bathroom. So we'll start over here, in fact. So this bedroom is going to be labelled bedroom 3, whereas the landlord labels it bedroom first floor A. So in this room, we've got the double bed to the left, storage here to the right with built-in space. So we've got that here, one shelf up top. And a view from this angle, and we'll be able to see the standalone wardrobe and two chests of drawers. So, outside of the window, we get this view. Next, will be the bathroom for upstairs. So, 
that's in there. We've got the bathtub at the end, toilet, and sink here to the left with the mirror above. So that's the bathroom. Radiator down below for your towels. So now, over here we'll have two more bedrooms. This first room being bedroom number four or first floor B. And in this room, we'll have two standalone wardrobes, built in space, got the chest of drawers here at the end double bed and then a desk to the right as we enter so lots of space lots of storage lots of light due to the very big windows across the whole wall and then let's just quickly have a look inside of the storage so we've got the rear laptop and one shelf and then as for the built-in storage very sturdy built-in a very sturdy standalone wardrobe here one top up top and down below. As for this next wardrobe, we'll just have the one shelf up top and rail. And a view from the window reveals the patio outside and then the buildings in the distance along with the trees so that's this bedroom and then finally we'll have bedroom 5 or bedroom first floor C so here in this room we've got the storage first thing to the left the chest of drawers you can see the desk in the corner on the left single bed this time to the right and then wardrobe space behind the door with the standalone wardrobe. And a very similar view outside of the window. So that concludes it for this flat. So that has been it for this five bedroom flat in Roehampton. For more information, make sure to check out spotterhome.com. Until next time, bye bye.